Twitter users are now wondering if mandatory blue checks are actually illegal. Spoiler alert, nobody actually knows the answer, but it's probably not worth filing a lawsuit over. Okay, I'll admit it. I did not expect the Twitter check apocalypse to result in drill accusing Elon Musk of violating federal consumer protection laws. So it's been four days since Musk removed the last legacy verified check marks, leaving Twitter's blue checks in the hands of people who pay $8 a month for Twitter blue. Or at least that was the idea. But as of Monday morning, uh, here's how it's gone. Legacy check marks did in fact disappear, leaving only checks bestowed through the paid Twitter blue service. Elon Musk revealed that he was comping a few Twitter blue subscriptions for celebrities, you know, those people who mainly criticize the Twitter blue verification in the first place, like Stephen King and LeBron James. And as all of this was unfolding, a group of users, including weird Twitter legend Drill, launched a block the blue checks campaign to mass block anyone with a check mark. What it doesn't 